A decade after the original release of the PlayStation Vita, Sony announced Project Q, which would eventually become the PlayStation Portal. Project Q originated to host online gaming sessions in the cloud. This accessory is not a replacement for the PS Vita or the PSP, but rather an addition to the PS5's remote play feature. It comes with an LCD and can produce a very realistic gaming environment when combined with the DualSense controller's motion sensors. So in this video, we'll tell you why you should buy the PlayStation Portal, so stay tuned till the end. But before starting, make sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And now, let's get started. What is the PlayStation Portal? The PlayStation Portal is a shining example of Sony's commitment to innovation in online gaming. It originates in the groundbreaking Project T. This innovative piece of equipment completely transforms the gaming landscape by removing the barriers between home consoles and online play. The PlayStation Portal stands out because of the solid connection it establishes with the PlayStation 5 via a Wi-Fi network that is both reliable and blazingly fast. This incredible achievement is made possible by Sony's reliable remote play feature, which has survived the test of time and is compatible with various electronic gadgets. The PlayStation Portal can be used on any device, from a handheld game console to a tablet, laptop, smartphone, and desktop computer. Since it provides a specialized environment developed exclusively for portable devices, it has carved out a niche as the go-to option for PlayStation gamers on the go. If you want to use remote play, you should have a fast internet connection. Sony recommends at least 5 maps, although a speed of at least 15 maps is suggested for the best gaming experience. The PlayStation Portal may not look as sleek as other competing handheld devices, but the design choice was not made without good reason. Every inch of this gadget has been carefully sculpted to highlight its most impressive qualities. An integral PlayStation 5 system features a high-resolution screen placed between the DualSense controllers, improving the game experience. As a result of this brilliant design decision, the PlayStation Portal can provide a true PlayStation experience without sacrificing gameplay portability or visual fidelity. Families with hectic schedules and frequent vacationers are the perfect demographic for the PlayStation Portal. For busy families, when finding time to sit in front of the TV can be a struggle, this portable marvel is a godsend. The PlayStation Portal is a must-have accessory for avid gamers who are constantly on the go and like to travel and see the globe, but also need a consistent gaming environment. Playing games whenever and wherever the player pleases provides a more fulfilling gaming experience. Sony has always been committed to making groundbreaking innovations, and this latest one exemplifies that dedication. The PlayStation Portal fully displays Sony's commitment to innovation, which takes mobile gaming to new heights and fulfills the community's long-held hopes for more portable consoles. Best and Worst Features The PlayStation 5 DualSense controller's groundbreaking color coding of buttons has revolutionized how we interact with video games. The customizable triggers and haptic feedback it provides take the gaming experience to a whole new level for compatible games. In addition, a create button and motion sensors are included to meet the needs of our content-driven society. The two actuators in the controller allow for responsive tension changes and they are fully connected to the PlayStation Network. Even with all of its improvements, the DualSense still excels in terms of ergonomics, making it easy to hold and reducing fatigue when using it. The Portal's controller is designed to be lightweight, making it more comfortable to use and improving the gameplay experience. The 8-inch LCD screen on the PlayStation Portal is a technical wonder, capable of displaying full 1080 quality at a smooth 60 frames per second. This ensures that consumers can experience HD content in its purest form. The USB-C port further improves connectivity, so your 5 pounds in Portal are always connected and ready to go. The Portal isn't without its flaws, though. Notably, the much-anticipated ability to stream games from a £4 using the PlayStation Plus Premium Cloud service is not included. However, this restriction is tempered by the strong security mechanisms that prevent anyone from gaining unauthorized access to the user's PlayStation while using the portal. Sony's proprietary PlayStation Link has replaced Bluetooth, resulting in different audio options. Although wired headphones can be plugged in via the 3.5mm connector, the internal wireless audio alternatives made available by PlayStation Link have become a requirement, albeit an inconvenience, for many players. 
Pulse has announced the Pulse Elite wireless headset and the Pulse Explore wireless earbuds, which use planar magnetic drivers to provide high-quality music with low latency and no signal loss. These accessories provide a pristine, fully immersive audio experience when used with PlayStation Link. The Pulse Elite headset has a detachable boom mic, while the Pulse Explore earbuds have two mics for better sound quality when talking. Both models also include a USB converter with various electronic gadgets. Wireless headphones may be commonplace for handheld consoles, but those who play Portal want something more immersive. However, progress is always being made, so gamers may look forward to a future where total oral immersion is the norm. Is it worth the money? Comparisons have been made between the $249.99 Nintendo Switch Lite and the $199.99 PlayStation Portal with the DualSense Edge controller. Many prefer the Switch Lite because it can be used offline and with Bluetooth for gaming. However, each device serves a unique purpose. The more expensive portal is unnecessary for the Switch Lite to function properly. Those who must constantly travel to and from different locations will find the portal a godsend. Despite the skills gap and other disadvantages, most 5 pounds users may use their already owned devices for remote play. The portal's appeal would skyrocket if virtual reality games and cloud streaming were added to PlayStation Plus Premium. The lack of Bluetooth for increased audio through PlayStation Link looks like a mistake on the PlayStation Vita compared to the Wii U gamepad, which handles connectivity issues without affecting gameplay. And that's it for today. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you next time.